I'm vlogging, it's Vlogmas, it's a lot of fun, I'm vlogging, it's Vlogmas, let's see what I got done, Merry Christmas! Hello, good morning. Sorry, I didn't film much this morning. I, I kind of showed you my coffee and now I'm here. Good morning, welcome to Vlogmas day six, seven. I don't know what day we're on, I think we're on seven. Um, I am driving to work and I'm not gonna lie, I am really not doing well on the vlogging part of vlogmas right currently now you might not have noticed but like I honestly am like I don't want to pick up my phone to vlog and that's just because I'm kind of in a mental funk right now I'm just like I don't want to do anything I feel like everything I do is kind of like blah, blah, blah. it's boring it's like what am I doing life is boring <laughs> like every day is the same like I don't know if it's just because I need like winter break to happen soon or I'm just going through it. You know, like you go through ups and downs and right now I'm, I'm in a down place. Like, I'm just like, every day I'm like, okay, here we go again. And at the end of the day, I am like, I'm looking forward to the next day because I'm like, well, next tomorrow might be a better day. But then I'm starting today and I'm just like, it's another day, here we go. Like, nothing is actually going wrong. I'm just like mentally unhappy, so. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to 2021, that's kind of how life is. Sometimes you just don't feel happy. Anyways, I'm gonna try to get myself out of this funk and try to be more positive because when I feel like this, I don't like it. I'm gonna try to be happy, happy. I mean, tomorrow is exciting because I don't have to be teaching kids. I have a professional learning day, so I'll just be in meetings and I don't have to teach, which will be a nice little break. Um, so I can see that as a positive. Going to the gym today, is that a positive? Yeah, the gym. I don't know what else to say. I'm driving to work, I'll see you there. Pookie out here. I like it. <sighs> oh my gosh. So I, for being honest, I am not happy still. <laughs> I mean, you know I'm not happy. I said it this morning. I'm just not doing great. <sighs> I had my hardest first graders today and they just like hurt my feelings a lot. <laughs> Which is crazy to think a six year old can hurt your feelings, but oh my gosh, when I have a six year old screaming bloody murder at the top of their lungs saying they hate me, yeah, it hurts a little bit. So yeah, they, and there was no reason for this kid to yell at me either. Like I, I hate the whole class, this class is insane. You haven't heard about it vlogmas, but they're literally insane. I've been complaining about them since day one. The class is full of just kids that are poor sports. So if you try to do any activity with them and you don't have time for everyone to have a turn, they cry, they throw fits, they say they hate you because they didn't get a turn. And so I'm like, well, we're gonna move on so everyone can have a turn and do some coloring. We're gonna do some coloring. They yell at me, no, I don't wanna do coloring. And I'm like, you said you wanted to at the beginning of class. You were all excited about it. Like, what are you talking about? They come to class, literally as they were standing outside my door, I open the door and I say, hi, all right, come on in, find your spot, take a seat, we'll get started. And the first two girls were the two girls that, well, one of them said they hate me. The other one said they hate me before. They're both two girls that call, say they hate me every time. Anyways, these two girls, basically were wandering around the classroom the entire time. Every time I would tell them to sit on their spot so we can do the game or the next activity or something, they would just look at me and say no. And then like, keep doing what they're doing. I would tell them, don't, we're not playing the instruments today. Let's sit on our spots, let's play this game. See if you can remember these things kind of thing. Like, there's nothing I could have done to make them 
change the way they were behaving. Like, there was literally nothing I could do. Anyways, I don't even remember what happened at the end of class, but I was like, all right, time's up. Time to turn in your papers. Our, your teacher's right outside. And then, oh, that's what it was. I do Shining students every time I see kids. I uh, pick three kids at the end of class who did a really good job following directions and trying their best. I picked three kids who... I picked one of them before, I think. Actually, I think I picked three new kids all together. And I picked kids that were listening, following directions. And these were kids that have had hard times in the, in the past, and they did great today. And the two girls that at the beginning of class walked in and you pouted at me, they told me they hate me every time, they were like, why didn't you pick me? And I'm like, because you know how many times I had to ask you to sit in your spot? Like, and I was like, because I told you to sit in your spot multiple times and you didn't listen, because I asked you to not play my instruments and you didn't listen, and they just look at me and say that they hate me, and I'm like, there's no logic in six-year-olds' six minds. They just think that I hate them, and I am killing them with kindness. Like, I'm trying so hard to not be sarcastic or passive-aggressive or angry at all. Like, when they were, like, the end of class was just so chaotic because the one kid was screaming and crying. There was other kids screaming and crying too because they didn't get what they wanted. So there's about five, four to five kids crying, which is super loud, especially if they're, you know, screaming, crying. And then I'm trying to, like, have them line up and leave. And there's, like, three of them that are like, I'm not going anywhere. And I'm like, I have second graders coming. You have to leave my class. And then the, the one girl that was saying like yelling at me saying she hated me and crying the most she said i don't want to see your face ever again and i said okay then leave i literally said okay leave it's time for you to go leave my classroom and you don't have to see me anymore and she just like pouted at me and yelled more and i was like go away like all i was like like they weren't leaving and their teacher wasn't walking and i was all like there's like five kids still sitting on the ground three to five kids still sitting on the ground not leaving and i said bye everyone and I just kept waving, bye everyone, I'll see you later, have a great day, bye everyone, and I just kept doing that. And I was like, bye Miss Sullivan, bye! And then she's like, oh, bye Miss White, and then she left, because she was like, oh, I'm supposed to leave now. And I just kept waving, bye, have a great week, I'll see you later. Anyways, it was just a hard day. It was just a hard day, and I'm not gonna lie, I feel like, really sad. I just feel like, kind of hopeless with that class. And, like, in general, I've been sad today, like, I just have no motivation for anything today like I even I got halfway changed for the gym and then I was just like I just want to go home so I'm gonna go home I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna hug my boyfriend and complain about my day to him and try to feel better because this mental funk is bothering me a lot and I know the gym would probably help and would probably make me feel better but I don't want to drive there right now I just want to drive home so I'm gonna drive home because I can and I can live my life whatever way I want, so I'll see you at home. Goodbye. I'm back in the car with the bay. We're gonna go get tacos, cause it's Taco Tuesday. Taco Bell. Whoops, I already ate most of it, but ayo, Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. Ayo, Taco Tuesday. Ooh. Ooh. Woo, 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 woo. Advent day song. Another green square of soap. Funko Pop Day 7 Hagrid It's pretty big Oh sorry you can't see Oh he has his umbrella, it's cute Day 7 It's like it's over a green screen I think I forgot to put the green screen effect on it what is today's wine? Today is the 7th. 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 Oh, got it. A white wine. Pastello. Can y'all. Grigo. Great girl. G R I G I O. Grigo. From Del Venzi Dog, Italy. Okay. 
All right, that's it for uh, today's vlog. I'll see you little cuties later. Bye!